In math, factors are numbers that multiply to give you the original number. Therefore, 6 and 5 are factors of 30 because 6 times 5 equals 30. 6 itself can be factored as 2 times 3, but none of these numbers can be factored anymore. So 2, 3, and 5 are what we would call prime factors. We can also actually use these prime factors to find other ones. For example, 3 times 5 multiplying 2 of my prime factors gives me 15, which is another factor. 15 times 2 is 30. Or 2 times 5, which is equal to 10, is going to be a factor because 10 times 3 is equal to 30. We can extend this concept to algebra because ultimately variables just represent numbers. So 15xy has factors 3 and 5, which both go into uh, 15, but x and y themselves could also be considered factors because they multiply to give you your original here. Or we can even factor a trinomial like this as x plus 2 times x plus 3. And if you were going to FOIL these, you would get back to your original x squared plus 5x plus 6, which is a much bigger topic, um, but I just wanted to show you the connection. Ultimately, x plus 2 is some number, x plus 3 is some number, and when you multiply them together, it's going to be equal to this one. So finally, factors are what you can multiply together to get the original number. Hope this helps. Thank you.